my mom roasted me the other day shout out to mama kim she told me that i need to look prettier in my videos <laughs> jokes on her because i stole her jewelry <laughs> do i look presentable i spent like two hours getting ready this morning <laughs> Welcome back! What's up guys, it's Ange and today we're gonna be watching Maze Runner. I'm gonna be giving a commentary while looking like I should be a part of a Baz Luhrmann movie. <laughs> should I do Baz Luhrmann commentaries? Let me know. Also, shame on me because I love the Maze Runner trilogy, the books. Like, I read all the books and they were, they were pretty good, so I should have been on this. Before we begin, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button. If you haven't yet already, so you can stay tuned to all my content. I post three times a week. Follow me on all my social media. All my handles will be in the description below. And follow me on Twitch. I live stream every Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. If you guys want to check out the full-length, unedited commentary to this movie, make sure to check out my Patreon page. We can gain full access to that and future movie slash TV shows that I do on this channel. Alrighty, y'all. Let's jump straight into the commentary. Ooh, hands down, one of the best intros. This is also how the book starts, so very accurate. Love it. <laughs> Gets me every time. Okay, the real question is, why is he drenched? <laughs> Did they just hose him down before they sent him through? Also, why is this lift so aggressive? Ah! Help me! Good camera shot. Me when I leave my house for any social event. Hiss. Hiss. Damn one, Greeny. Rise and shot. Will Poulter honestly has a great American accent. He like nailed it. Sorry, I'm just gonna give a round of applause right now. Dylan O'Brien. Have you seen him now too? He's aging like fine wine. Hey there, Green Bean. Hi. Movies in depth calls me Green Bean. Oh no, String Bean. What is the difference between string bean and green beans? Are they the same thing? Are they not? Does it matter? Probably not, but it matters to me. Whatever we need, the box provides. Are you saying that I'm what you need? Are you alright, Albie? <laughs> green bean, meet Newt. Newt! My favorite character! Newt is actually the best character in the book. Him and Minnow are the best. Don't, I don't, I don't, Thomas, Teresa, shh. Newt, Minnow, can't convince me otherwise. I would build a treehouse just for the sake of building a treehouse. Well, I'd probably be like, yeah, 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 it's to keep lookout, to see everything, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's for my own enjoyment. You only have three rules. Do your part. No time for any freeloaders. Second, never harm another glader. Most importantly, never. Go beyond those walls. So, like, tell me why he breaks all those rules later. <laughs> hey, Chuck. Where you been, man? They always gotta throw in the kid. Like, the second you saw him as a character, the second that I read him as a character, I knew this, this dude is dying. This little nugget, the author is gonna make me fall in love with him, and then they're gonna be <laughs> murder him, right? Mino! Also a fine specimen! Ki Hong Lee? I remember when it was announced that he got casted for this. I started flipping out because I've read the book. I know Ki Hong Lee from the small little comedy skits from Wong Fu. Both my worlds colliding. Hey. Whoa, yo, you didn't have to chuck me. All right, calm, 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 calm. Calm? You just yeeted me 10 feet. Calm? I'd be so mad. I'd be like, let me at him. Let me at him. Not the dramatic wind. <laughs> Everyone's like, ooh. <laughs> ah. <laughs> How do you think an actual group of teenage boys would do? Would it be this organized? You can't tell me. My brother can't even keep his dirty clothes inside the hamper. Like, <laughs> you're telling me they're running a whole society here? Like. <laughs> the runners are the only ones that really know what's out there. And the fastest of us all. And it's a good thing too, because if they don't make it back before those doors close, then they're stuck out there for the night. No one's ever survived the night in the maze. Until now. Ooh, but they haven't met me. No, no one wants to be a runner. And besides, you've got to get chosen. You have to chosen by who? <laughs> Ow. What do you say, Greeny? Want to see what you're made of? Not really. Come on, Greeny. We're not done yet. 
Don't shuffle back like that at me. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Thomas. <laughs> Hit to the header and he remembers his name. You know, I feel like this entire intro sequence could have been so cheesy, but I think it was shot very well and edited very well. Got the shot up of all the flames going up and like, I don't know, like the way that they mixed it and edited this moment just made it less cheesy. No, just get the fertilizer. You know where it is, it's out in the middle of the woods. Yeah, where are you going for this fertilizer? I'm not a agriculturist. Oh my gosh, uh, 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 oh my gosh, that's dead bodies. I would freak out, run, leave. Oh. <gasps> hey, what are you doing in the middle of the woods? Are you trying to get fertilizer too? Well, Albie. Yeah. What's gonna happen to him? Wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> that's gotta hurt every time. Y'all not gonna do any like ceremony for him or something maybe like a funeral <laughs> or say your goodbyes or you just gotta forget about him not like you knew him anyways so i guess it's easy for thomas to forget about it why aren't we training more runners like why are there only two people going out every single day i know people aren't like competent enough to like run so then why don't you train people to get better at running so more people can look so that it takes a faster time i guess or like more ground is covered or i don't know do you know what i'm saying i understand there can't be too many people doing the job because then it can get messy it can get unorganized and it will no longer be efficient but at least more than two what happens if they don't make it they're gonna make it how do you know there goes that dramatic gust of wind again This is a great shot here. When he, like, everything slows down and then he pounces. Makes it so intense. <laughs> You're so dumb, Thomas. You just killed yourself. What? What? Ever. Go beyond those walls. No one's ever survived the night in the maze. Survives the night in the maze. What? I still can't believe Thomas's first instinct was to run into the maze. You know what? Self confidence through the roof. Like, okay, wait, maybe no. okay, just a little more. Sorry, what? Oh, he still holds on to him and he hides inside the leaves. That's crazy. I'd be hyperventilating. Are you kidding? Could not handle it. 10 out of 10 acting because he's literally it, you got to remember these actors are literally reacting to nothing i don't know what they would do to like help track these actors are reacting to not the actual monsters <laughs> oh my gosh thomas thomas i don't even want to know what that is oh, 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 oh. you gotta send it and grip on for dear life your hands are gonna burn. Thomas, like, kills this one. I forget how, though. <laughs> oh my gosh! Mina wa! Time and place, man! <laughs> oh, again, shot so well. <laughs> oh, I wish they didn't cut to black, though. Oh, that's such a cop out. But I get it. It's for like they wanted this dramatic moment of like, oh, did they survive or not? But it's like obviously we know they survived. So it's a little cheesy. Kind of tacky. I don't know how they would do it otherwise though. So I'm not complaining. Okay, that guy is stung though. So y'all gonna have to push him out anyways. You just did him dirty. <laughs> you saw a griever. You didn't just see it. He killed it. Yeah, he did. He's not like the rest. He's not like others. He's different. For three years, we have coexisted with these things. And now, you've killed one of them. Who knows what that could mean for us? When I turned tail and ran, this dumb shank stood behind to help Albie. I say we make him a runner. The staging of the actors, camera composition, very impressive. I think that's really hard to do with 
20 plus actors in the same room and trying to frame these like really beautiful shots. All right. <laughs> Chuck is me, just vibing to his own rhythm. <laughs> oh, it's a girl. What? About freaking time. I think she's dead. Okay, clearly she's not dead. Why would they send up a dead girl? She's the last one ever. What the hell does that mean? <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> don't look at me. I don't know her. You'd say that no one's ever seen a griever and lived to tell about it, right? You know, now we have one. You're telling me you're not even a little bit curious. You're trying to perform surgery on a griever? I like where your mind's at, Dylan. Thomas. Whoa. <laughs> you're not going back out there alone. Meet me in the woods in half an hour. This be enough? Okay. So like why meet in the woods and be all like secretive and hidden and whatnot? And yet everyone can see you five plainly running into the maze. That's disgusting. I'm with you, brother. <laughs> oh my gosh, that scared me. <laughs> he didn't like that. Was it reflex? You hope. It was inside a griever. These are the same letters we get in our supplies. Whoever put us here obviously made the grievers. And this is the first real clue, the first anything you've found in over three years, right, Mino? Right. The rules are the only thing that have ever held us together. Why now are we questioning that? Because we have new information on how to get out. There's a fine line between keeping the rules and also like forgetting the objective at hand. So let's just make this official. Starting from tomorrow, you're a runner. Yeah, you are. You gotta do what it takes to get out, you know, or die trying at least. Well, at the same time, you want to do what's good for everybody, keeps everyone safe, minimalize the casualties. I get it. But that's why I love Galley's character. He really brings the other perspective into this. Without him, I think this would be a more boring film, for sure. If there was a way out, we would have found it by now. Why haven't you told anyone this? It was Albie's call. People needed to believe we had a chance of getting out. Hope is everything. Hunger Games? A little bit of hope is effective. What are you guys doing? You're not allowed in here. It's the girl. What, is she awake? You can say that. <laughs> Girls are awesome. <laughs> yeah, they are. <laughs> I don't think she likes us very much. What do you want? Dude, I'd be terrified too if I woke up with, uh, surrounded by a bunch of dudes. Too much testosterone. It's Thomas! It's Thomas! Okay, I'm gonna come up, okay? She's like, fine. But only because I like your face. Teresa, I'm Thomas. You already knew that. Yeah, how come she gets more info in her brain? Who are you? Ooh, what a powerful question. Who are you? And he goes, I don't have no idea. Okay. Thomas, how you grabbed that sword made me really nervous. This is what all girls are like. Yep, yeah, pretty much. I remember water. Feeling like I was drowning. And this voice. This woman's voice saying the same thing over and over. Wicked is good. Yeah, they literally brainwashed you. Do you think the people who created the maze are just like watching? Kind of like the Hunger Games too. Do you think they know all the conversations that are going down? These were in my pocket when I came up. What? What if we were sent here for a reason? Okay, yeah, obviously you guys were sent there for a reason. Ugh, cheesy line. <laughs> you shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be here. Albie, relax, please. <laughs> Teresa, that was a little aggressive. <laughs> oh my gosh. All you had to do was prick him. You didn't have to stab him through the arm. <laughs> Sundown, Greenie. Time to go. Why aren't we calling the chick Greenie? She's a newbie too. Can I, can I be relinquished from this name now? Everything started going wrong the minute you showed up. Gally, I know you need to blame someone and something for all of this, but maybe it's just time for change, all right? Ah, uh, it's just another dead end. That doesn't look like a dead end to me. Yeah, or there could be a dozen grievers on the other side. Thomas doesn't know what he's done as usual. Yeah, well, at least I did something. You've been here three days, all right? I've been here three years. Yeah, you've been here- He's only been here three days? We, we might have just found a way out of the maze. We can't. Oh. Can't leave. Oh yeah, he knows everything now, right? 
He has his memories back. He knows that the world has gone to shoop it a shoop. Ha! Ah. <laughs> All the doors are opening. Yo, the people outside the maze said, hurry up and figure it out or you're stuck here and it's a death wish. Hurry, everybody hide! Yes, runny cam! I love me a good shaky cam. That's gotta be a workout and a half for the cameraman. That's all I'm saying. Y'all gotta stop complaining about the shaky cam because one, it's good. Two, people will be putting a lot of effort for those shots, okay? <laughs> nice job, Teresa. 10 out of 10. Well, obviously, their job right now is to destroy the glade. So, run into the maze. Come on! Hey, yo. You know how hard it is to spear throw? I tried during my Spartan race. I suck at it. There's probably like a science to the throw. Man, I don't know it. No way that that silly old door is holding back the griever. Okay, so the griever's smart. He's architecturally intelligent. <laughs> Get them up. Dylan can just get these expressions on his face of absolute terror and anxiety, like, so well. Gally. It's great. Oh, 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 oh. How are you still blaming me? Like, that's wild. Guys, I'm one of them. The people who put you here, I worked with them. Why, what was the reason for them going into the maze, though? I forget. Because the people we were before the maze, they don't even exist anymore. What does matter? is who we are now and what we do right now. I love that, because it's so true. Sure, we could have been horrible people in our pasts, but it doesn't mean that we're not capable of change. We're not capable of holding ourselves accountable and making ourselves better with each and every day. It's what you choose to do with yourself now, you know? Yeah, what if Thomas is right? Maybe he can lead us home. We are home. It literally was set up into flames last night. The creators can just relinquish the grievers again, like. Do you hear me? I said tie him off! <laughs> yeah, kick him where it hurts, Teresa. You don't have to come with us, but we are leaving. Anyone else who wants to come, that's your last chance. But I'd rather risk my life out there than spending the rest of it in here. He said, I'm gonna die trying. Someone give him a mic so he can drop it. Yeah, honestly, when you got like 15 plus bodies on this thing, 14 plus bodies on this thing. <laughs> Y'all gotta do like a strategic push at the same time, you know? Kind of like tug of war when you guys all pull at the same time. Get push all the same, you know? Mino can't die. He's the only one that knows the code. Six, four, eight, three. Got it. Yeah, javelin throw! What? That was an epic end. The sequence of the code to the changing maze and grievous grievers coming through and ooh! So well done. Epic music, shaky cam. Honestly, one straight hallway. Even more terrifying than a maze. <laughs> Tell me why this is creepier than the maze. Hello. My name is Dr. Ava Page. The sun has scorched our world. Billions of lives lost to fire. Famine. The fallout was unimaginable. Ooh. You didn't have to add the images. We called it the flare, a deadly virus that attacks the brain. Like, please. As you'll no doubt soon discover, not everyone agrees with our methods. That makes a, a lot of sense. Like you're putting kids in harsh conditions to study their brain activity. That doesn't sound very ethical to me, but I'm sure they are trying to outweigh finding a cure. More important. 
wicked is good. If I'm remembering correctly, this is the start of another test. We did, Callie, we're out. We're free. Free? <laughs> you think we're free out there? Yo, his acting, 10 out of 10. Will Poulter? I belong to the maze. That's a great line. I belong to the maze. We all do. Oh, poor little Chuck. Sacrificed his life for Thomas. <laughs> Why is he such a valiant little boy? That's so tragic. Oh my gosh. Chuck. Why is he the bravest and sweetest little kid ever? Kids usually aren't like that, right? They're selfish little brats. Except for our boy Chuck. See, I love how they have these moments where they just like, it's so action packed, but they lower all the sound and raise up the score. Don't worry, you're safe now. Liar, you absolute liar, I don't trust you. So let's move forward. It's time now to begin phase two. They're literally just being taken to another location where they have to survive even harsher conditions. Like, it's so horrible. I actually didn't mind watching this for like the third or fourth time. It's, it's just like a cool story. Like, sometimes I'm wowed by how creative and imaginative humans are. So whenever anything is like just, you know, out of the box like this, it's a cool moment. Of course, there's some flaws here and there, but not every story can be perfect. And I, I feel like we'd get, we can get too nitpicky with like the details of the cure and how that works. And it's just like not important. Just like enjoy the story, I guess. And I think more than anything, I really like the characters of this film, which is usually for me in movies, characters are not as important. The story is more important. And in TV shows, the characters are very important to me. But I think the characters in this film particularly carry the story so happy with how they portrayed all the characters in the books i know that we get more uh insight on a lot more characters it's just hard to do in a film and to get all that screen time for all those characters but no matter still was really really good i kind of want to reread the books now i do remember another character that i really really love that's going to be introduced in the next movie so that's exciting and yeah let me know what you guys thought about this movie if you've read the books before how do you like this adaptation and if you haven't read the books what did you think about this story overall thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed that commentary make sure you leave it a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't yet already so you can stay tuned to all my content and don't forget to check out my last video if you guys want to check out the full link commentary to this movie make sure to check out my patreon page we can gain full access to that and future movie slash tv shows that i do on this channel Alrighty, y'all have the best day ever and i'll see you guys in the next one bye k okay, bye k okay, bye k okay, bye i gotta pee really bad i gotta go pee it's the bad thing about movie commentaries it takes freaking two hours to film but i gotta pee